Well, the Hell Runner one, and here we have another Lego Movie 2 set review, but also my first of the, like, like, late summer wave, or what, and the name of which being Sistar Party Crew, and Good Morning Sparkle Babies, yeah. So we'll start off with the boxes, like we always do, the Lego logo, Lego Movie 2 logo, and the uh, smaller version of the main border of which, then a picture of everything that comes within, and the age range, set number, name, and the amount of pieces. Actual size on the top. Then on the back, there's just some alternate shots of everything included, and some highlights of, or also of what to do in each one, and yeah. And on to the two booklets, both of which very small ones. So Good Morning Sparkle Babies, very small, but not so thin of a booklet. And then on in the back, just after Lego Life, and that just no ask for the other side. And then, and then so Star our Party Crew, same thing. But actually, it does have some ads for both, very few for the earlier Winter Wave and also the earlier Summer Wave of sets. And then also the list of pieces included, which is three pages, and then Lego Life in there. On to Good Morning Sparkle Babies is get, get just Emmett. Oh, it prints of which, same as it's been, or same as the beginning of the year with the first wave of sets, but different face print. And see, interesting expression given to him. And that's the, oh, it's holding one of the cylinder pieces, but acting as a, uh, you know, uh, as a drink of some kind, yeah. Back torso print, also not as much, but back face print of which, also exclusive to this set. And also get Lucy, of which also somewhat exclusive to this, but as you see, it does have the blue hair piece, like in the uh, uh, Sparkle Spa set. And also, and this being a cheaper alternative to that, and also an easier way to get it without getting the uh, minifig series version, and also like the minifig series version, does include the Everything's Awesome album of which. And back torso or face print of which, also exclusive to this set. And also get. Both of the like new Sparkle Babies. Some good update prints to the recent uh, Lego figure baby pieces. There's no back torso print. Okay, there we go. Nice to have alongside the sewer beans uh, pack set. And then on to the uh, Sistar Party Crew set. It is an exclusive variant of Benny. Which, as you can see, has the dual molded legs. Pretty cool to that. In blue and white. And then the uh, torso print, also very interesting. And the visor, which is with uh, star shaped glasses, also exclusive. Yes. 
Okay, there we go. So, and his face print of which kind of exclusive to this one, to this set. But the helmet piece of which this thing, and the other face print of which also. So, a little different than others underneath it. The same slight back torso print of which, which is a continuation of the front print. And, and the, so as for this time, this is the only way to get this version of Benny. And of course, cheap set to get as well. And then also next to which is this like party version of Unikin. And if you wonder, is this scarf thing an actual pie cleaner? No, it's not. It's just an actual clock piece included with it. And as you see, it does have the large high heel boot of some kind, just like in the party bus set. And exclusive tail print of which kind of interesting. And also the uh, face print of which I believe might be exclusive, I'm not sure, but can also swap it out with this one. And like in that scene. And besides that, same builds and everything. And I think that is it with all the mini things. Oh, and also for Good Morning Sparkle Babies is get another one of the star guys. But however, this one of which is exclusive prints or has an exclusive print tile to it. And also has one of them brackets to hang one of the sparkle babies onto and to fly around on and all of course. Onto the main build of Good Morning Sparkle Babies is, as you see, it's just kind of a grassy sort of area of Bricksburg, or reformed Bricksburg, if you've seen the end of it. But plenty of good uh, recolored mocking pieces, like these large leaf pieces in different colors, kind of interesting. And that newer leaf piece in orange, which is pretty neat. But like some good sloping around to end. Nice use of this of one of these rounded pieces, and if you wonder what the shovel piece is for, well, that's the main feature which I'll go over in a minute. Some fine sloping around, and also these other leaf pieces in blue, which I believe might be from elves, not sure. But anyways, so for the main feature of which is where you can get this underneath part of it and attach to the star there and remove the face tile and put one of the sparkle babies or whatever figure you want on it. And then just tap it in there. Uh, let's do it one more time. So, kind of a fun feature. And so for the builds included for Sistar Party Crew is you get this little dance floor which is just a 4x4 uh, uh, plate with translucent tiles to it to make it look like a dance floor. Although it would have been nice if they did like a whole bunch of these to make an extra large dance floor, but you can try and do it yourself with a piece on BrickLink and whatever. And also a little uh, stereo amp, there, which is just very simple dishes, plate, and slope to make it all work there. And also get a little stand for some cups of some kind with one of those pieces that, or one of the stand pieces that's been around for a long time, and also cylinders and those little upper holder things. But as seen in interesting and kind of coloring to it. Yeah. Into the main part of it, which is this uh, music dance form of Metal Beard. See, as for one, it has the peg leg leg. It is mostly made of like a telescope piece with a purple gem on it. Like it's like a dazzled peg leg. And does have some swivel movement and also has a purple rounded slope to it. And the other leg of which is just thick and blocky and does have a like a piano keyboard, which the chest will also have as well. And 
So in good use of those. Right? So we get a lot of these like rounded corner pieces in here. And as for the chest area, which same chest, same treasure chest piece in gold, but you can like put open and there's the sausages and bones for his gut. It's like the other couple versions. But as for this one arm of which probably with a dish piece probably to be a record or something and also similar hands to the other versions but with the cones and all and also same piece for the thumb but the other arm of which kind of a little similar to that but probably a little drum area thing on it and also a nice little build for a like trumpet ish kind of form, kind of built to it, but like metallic kind of pieces, which we don't see very often in nowadays. But as for the uh, middle body area, which has the regular Metal Gear piece, but in gold, which is very pretty nice for mocking and all. But also, you get some more of that going on. I'll uh, pull with one with the same effect as the peg leg of which did, and also a similar build but acting as in the form of a record player. And also the same flag thing as the other versions do, but also do have clamp piece in gold, which kind of does full back as well. So, an interesting color scheme of like. Uh, Gold, purple, and black, and some gray uh, there. And do have a couple of hooks to the side, just like a uh, battle ready version had in the earlier way. And same tile piece for a piano keyboard on there. So, as for a comparison of the uh, first version of Metal Gear, hang on. Your first version Metal Beard from 2014. And also in 2014 was a smaller version that was included in the Metal Beard Sea Cow set. It has to see. It does have some good similarities to it. Like, as it is, of course, treasure chest in the same place. The same. And also, same kind of hunched effect. And also, of course, the like cannon swapped for a trumpet and wheel swapped for a drum, like, obviously. Although, could have used a, like, smaller version of an anchor on the, on this version, like they did on the Metal Gear Sea Cow version. And, but, of course, it is what it is, I guess. But besides that, some good, uh, techniques all around to this one. And, yeah. Let me get a thing to go. Let's now on to the final verdict on all this. So the final verdict on these two sets is, I think these are which pretty cool, pretty nice, nice sets to have, like playing good mocking pieces on both of them, and also exclusive variant of Benny in the Sistar Party Crew set, and also only time getting the Sparkle Babies here, and also an alternate version of getting the like uh, pop star version of Lucy and. Yeah. If you're like looking to get these sets like for your Lego Movie 2 collection, then go ahead and pick them up. And if you want to get them for like minifigs exclude or at least for the pieces to mock with, then also go ahead and pick them up. And that's about it with this video and thanks for watching.